A new program in Ocean City sets out to provide hope and healing through art. In tonight's Heart and Soul, WBOC's Kimberly Wiggins explains how the creative process is being used to enhance physical, mental, and emotional well-being for those here on the Eastern Shore. Let's face it, life isn't always easy. In fact, sometimes it's just plain difficult from dealing with the loss of a loved one to battling an addiction to just trying to figure out how to make ends meet. Now, a new class here at Ocean City aims to help you deal with the stress of life, hoping to help you heal your soul. And I can have what I want. Drawings. Organizer Debbie Dean Colley says this new class at the Art League of Ocean City is meant for anyone who needs help turning a new page. It's geared towards <clears throat> someone that is that is struggling perhaps or maybe you know an addiction or a loved one of an addiction, loss, um, an illness, um, someone just seeking some healing. Nearly a dozen artists and novices turn out to learn how to make journals. It's the first of a new series of classes called Art and Soul. Help you get your body back into balance. Guest speaker and wellness advocate Michelle Schachter opened participants' minds and nostrils with a whiff of some essential healing oils. I think it's all very important to find ways and tools to help us get through life. And then those here got to work. I have different colors that I like and then the little hearts. And I like the beach, so I got a shell. <laughs> I'm making a journal and this is the first time for me and I am not artistic at all. But I was really interested in this class because I love the idea of connecting art with healing. Dean Colley says the idea of using art to heal is truly a personal one. It's helped me heal through um, some losses in my life. And I thought, you know, why not? But why art? All what you make it be. Dean Colley says there's no judgment, just creativity, love, and freedom of expression. And it seemed to resonate with those here. We've been going through some stuff. And we needed an outlet. I'll go ahead and say I've been to a rehab before, mm -hmm. and there was hardly any expressive outlets. And I'm like doing this now, and I'm like, wow, I totally forgot about everything that what happened today. It's helping. I'm having fun with my daughter. It kind of makes you sit and talk to yourself more. And yeah, that's what a lot of people, I think, are scared to do. The class was free. Organizers hope a grant will keep it that way. So everyone who needs the therapy gets it. I'm having a good time. I don't know what's gonna, what it's going to look like. I, I hope they go home and know that they are loved. And Worcester County for Heart and Soul, Kimberly Wiggins. I'm excited to get creative. WBOC News, Ocean City. Organizers say they're still working on getting a grant for the class and for details on upcoming classes and when you can try the next one, head to our website, WBOC.com.